This video is all about connecting your template pages to a global color palette in Astra. In the last tutorial that I did, we went ahead and installed some template pages with the plugin Spectra. Now the plugin is very nice. It has a bunch of templates that come with it. So when you go to a new page, add new, and you can use this button template kits. And then we went ahead and we installed some template pages, uh, the digital agency one, this one here. You can select the page you want to install and install it. And that was in the last tutorial. I'll leave it in the description. But anyway, when you select a page you want to look at and then you preview site with the button at the bottom, it will open up the page and it'll open up this customized tab. When you click that, you'll see a color palette that it's using. If you want to duplicate this color palette, like if you just installed this page as is and your theme, your Astra theme hasn't set the color palette yet, it's not going to match the template page. To get it to match the template page, this is what this video is all about. If you right click and you inspect this little palette here or whatever you use to inspect your browser, you can make a note of these five colors. These first five global colors are what we're going to transcribe into the Astra theme. And then we can go ahead and install the template page. And then we got to go back to our customizer. So now we'll go to settings, uh, appearance, uh, on the side appearance customize and if you are running the Astra theme you will have global colors and this is the global color palette that we need to copy so I'll put those five colors in that we just transcribed and you can also see that these are global colors as well that are set so when you choose one of these, it has that latitude and longitude uh, circle, meaning it's global. So when you use one of those colors, it's going to pull it from this global color palette. So now that we have our global colors set, it should go ahead and match on our page if our page is using global colors. So we go back to pages, we go back to home, edit this is the template that we installed and we go to the list view and go down to a container that uses like one of the colors that's easy to tell and then on the side we have uh, the the settings and then we have the block setting style here's the background color for this block and you'll see that it's using a global color they're listed right down here. These are your global colors. You can change it to a different global color by clicking individually using them. And then if you actually change the color here, you're no longer using a global color. So you can change all of your global colors by changing it back in the customizer. And then every single widget in your site that pulls from that color will change. If you just go ahead and set the background of this to uh, green, then you're going to have to change it every single time. And if you set it to a global color, then it will pull it from the global color palette. I hope you found this video helpful and I will see you next time.